little bit later because I heard MVD dropped out because he was red. I guess he was reg. Um, I saw two spots open. I'm like, yo, register this time. And he's like, bro, I'm driving. So on the call, I vlogged him for him, paid for him, got him registered. Nice. Dude, right. get, get, get yourself a friend like Van. I got it. All right, so Palutena, Roy, this is definitely a like a character matchup we've seen throughout Ultimate history. Both of these characters, right out the gate in the beginning of Ultimate, were you know very promising, very strong. Palutena has received nerfs. I don't think Roy has ever been nerfed, right? Roy has not been nerfed. Palu nerfs. Um, her grab got nerfed. That's probably the biggest. Thing. The biggest one, yeah. And yeah, then she's fair too. Fair, fair is more uh, not as. Uh, it's, it's, it's the same as back here now. Right, 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 right. So it's, it's not as safe. Fair is not as safe as yeah. it was. But it's still minus four. So like. <laughs> You know. Used to be minus two, now minus four. As wow. Well. Very, wow. <laughs> Game and Watch can up it now, lol. Wow. Cool. <laughs> I do. I think it changes very specific matchups. It's like, it's nice, yeah. like any character that had like a frame three option, now you can hit fair. Uh, now Palutena can't be as aggressive, but do I think Palutena is still like a top five character? Yes, I do. Um, the grab, like you said, was the biggest hit, but that grab definitely didn't feel like the reason why Palu was so strong, right? Yeah. Yeah, right now we've got a pretty even game back and forth. Uh, Chase has made, missed a couple of ledge interactions, which has given Nico a bunch of opportunities to come back. Okay, Nico like playing the ledge game right now, playing good range. I like how Nico's not really rushing this corner scenario. Seriously. Even the run in, just like we see a lot of movement. We've seen like two or three jabs in the span of like you know 15 seconds, yeah. which you know for most Roy players like they they probably pr pressed 15 buttons in that. The scariest thing about Nico is that he isn't he isn't a player who always swings. He's not a he's not like a super uh, throwing out moves pressure player. He's a player where he's very like in your range. I'm I'm going to be here always reacting to you. He's, he's a resident swordy main. Okay, that's gonna be it. Yeah, he's a resident swordy main. He, all, he he knows these sword characters in and out. He knows how to get in on you. And I like the uh, the trump there coming out from Chase. You, yeah. I've seen Palutena's use up air. I think in that scenario, maybe up air wouldn't have KO'd. So, but Chase really made sure to put the backer really close to the um, uh, ledge, just because of you know a lot of characters. When you get trump, you can like quote unquote di the trump, go more in towards the stage, and you know pretty much end up on stage or very close to the stage. But here comes Nico getting a bunch of damage here. What's the ledge trap? Let's get that. Yeah. Ooh, big damage coming out. This has been a very even set. Yeah, going really back and forth. I feel like um, both of them not really pulling the trigger too hard off stage. Obviously, we're probably not going to see Roy go off stage versus Palu. But I really, I really wonder when Chase is going to try to find his opening off stage. Um, he seems very comfortable just uh, opting for the ledge trap. Okay. Very safe there. Ooh, that is. The delay on the air dodge is really good too. Both players playing so safe. Right yeah. Now. Ooh, almost got the sour up air. Maybe if you went for a full hop up air. Can you get the conversion? There's no double jump. You get the air dodge, but no trigger gets pulled here. Okay. Yeah, both players playing very safe means neither of them are committing too hard. And we're seeing this. They're just waiting for an opening, waiting for an opening. Yeah, and and I love this neutral Chase, play. Yeah, Chase is very ambiguous with his nares too. Like sometimes he'll do hard drift in, sometimes he'll drift out. Like. Yeah. Um, and we don't see a lot of dash tag coming out from Chase either. Um, I, true, true. I haven't actually seen uh, Dash tag is a very strong Palutena move, but um, we, we see Chase opting for more movement. Um, and this, this is actually something, just like even when I played against him, I complimented him a lot. I was like, you, you have a lot of like patience in advantage state, right? Yeah. A lot of players, they want to they wanna push the advantage state in that instant, but sometimes you just got to be patient. Only one dash tag. Yeah, he's not forcing his way through, which I see a lot of Paulus trying to do with dash attack because yes. it's so good. It is good at forcing your way through. Yeah. I mean, it's uh, it's but, definitely but, armored. But Roy is a character where he's so fast, he's got good frame data, you can't push your way through against Roy. Yeah. So I like how patient he's playing. Okay, you got good frame. Ooh, almost picked it up off the last hit. I know sometimes when you get that last hit with Paulu, you can either go into the nair depending on the DI, or sometimes you have to like go into dash attack and grab. Okay. Big damage. The overshoot on the up B, though. Oh, he definitely wanted to fall through aerial there. Still a really even game, man. And Nico's got the juggle. He's got the corner. And Chase takes the back there. Okay, there's the double jump, the air dodge. Safe backer goes all the way down. Nico is hunting this for is, Chase right now. This is close. It might not seem close on the percents, but it's close. Oh, yeah, it's definitely close. Okay, wait a minute. Here's the explosive uh -oh. flame. No jump. Oh, he has a jump. He has a jump. Okay. Oh, air dodge into the spot dodge. Gets him through. There's. Oh, wait a minute. Back uh -oh. throw. He has the double jump. He's gonna go off stage, yeah. There's a counter. He's gonna jump. Yeah, that's that's it. That's I don't it. think he can make it back. Oh, he back. Bro, he's what? Broken. Chase doesn't finish that off there. Oh man, I mean, 
maybe be, I forget Hesitated. what happened exactly, but yeah, because like, I, I thought he was just oh. dead as well, but second chance of life on the here. hunt. Oh, man. I, when is the dash stack coming out, man? <laughs> Dude, Nico is on the hunt right now. This is this is scary because it's like scary. It, it's so it's so hard to commit in this scenario. It's either player, right? Yeah. You just want to get your ledge trap. You want to get your juggle and just close it out from there. Look at Nico. He's closing the space so well. Wow, there, there's what? the dash start from Chase. Okay, Chase, getting he finds his way in with dash oh, yeah. so oh close. My God. The fair? Is it enough? Oh, it, barely. He air dodge, I think. Oh, from right? Yeah, yeah. I think he air dodged. I think he air dodged in. I don't know. Maybe, maybe jump would have saved him. I know. I, I know. Uh, did he hit him out of his jump, or what did he hit him out? Of? Oh, true. Yeah, I yeah. Think I think. Yeah, yeah. He had the air dodge. Yeah. If he hit him out of jump, I, I that was like such a scramble. I don't really remember. All I know, he got fair center stage. I don't know if he had double jump or not. Yeah. But. Yeah, that was really close. Cause really like, good, really good match. Cause in that scenario, like you want a directional air dodge just so you can like recover, right? Like you have to yeah. if you have no double jump. Yeah. Right? And at that point, it's up to Nico. Is, is he gonna catch you or not? But yeah, that was definitely Chase's game to win there. Uh, just didn't get the directional air dodge. Roy barely in range for that recovery. Um, we'll see. Seriously, yeah. Yeah, that that was such a close match. But both these players uh, just that game one. I, I just wouldn't be surprised if we have game three last off last hit. Yeah, and Chase looks like he's not slowing down. Yeah, the the rising fair, rising fair chain very on point, ending it off with the dash attack. Very solid damage. The teleport cancels as well. Okay. Okay, we got, the, we got the chase. We still got the chase. Okay. Woo! We got the chase. Chase, yeah. <laughs> chase is definitely getting a little bit more feistier with these dash attacks. I like it. Um, just kind of like catching some of these scramble scenarios. Um, with because Nico is opting, he's oh. not he's not as mashy as most Roy's. Yeah. So Nico will opt to move instead of mash. Wow. That but was really still, good yeah, Nico is able to sink these backers, and we've seen him. That's probably the most common move he's used to like take stock, and not even the jab in the backer. I don't even think Nico's gotten one of those yet. It's oh, just yeah. raw backers. Yeah. Hey, good patience from both players. Yeah. And that that sometimes you you have to. Uh, you, you kind of sometimes have to like check your opponent in a sense where it's like, oh, maybe he snapped back there? That's a weird pivot grab. But sometimes you have to check your opponent. If your opponent's staying back by roll, you don't necessarily have to pick a ledge option. You know what I mean? I feel like some people, yeah. they feel so pressured when they're on the ledge regardless of their opponent's yeah, position. Wait, wait. If they're standing by roll, you can you can take your time. There's no, there is no rush. 100% agree. So Chase down 60, and it's really hard to come back on Nico, but he's he, he's shown he can keep up with Nico. In your up there? Yep, off the off the platform. And uh, that's bounce. the most important thing is Nico. Is if you can keep up with him in neutral, then you can put up a fight. Yeah, yeah. If you can't keep up with him in neutral, you're, you're gonna get train wrecked. Yeah, it, it it definitely starts stacking up, starts becoming overwhelming, and it can yeah. definitely be a problem here. And Nico, Nico definitely opts to like not cover jump with meaties for his ledge trap. Oh, as I say that, he does it with death. <laughs> but it still gets the KO there. But yeah, definitely seems more like fade back, um, let you get away with the ledge jump if you opt for it. But you know, just transfer it more into a juggle situation. Yeah. Okay, falling back here. Okay, let's see Edgar right here. Oh, Tries to go for the two frame. I think he's standing too close. Yeah, yeah. Right? That that time it was too close. Okay. Maybe, maybe you wanted to walk instead of dash. There's maybe, yeah. Uh, he he, he kind of got there too quick. Oh, Ooh, no. Okay, okay it's not a regrab, not a regrab. The drag down? Doesn't go for up tilt. I don't know if up tilt would have killed there on the drag down there, but gets the back throw anyway. Maybe not with this rage. Yeah. Oh, man. The Both of these players are being very patient on ledge, which is yeah. very good. But Chase very is playing the slip. Yeah. Because yeah, one side B, one J at the ledge, and he's gone. But he's got to get it right now. Yeah, he's he's not like I feel like if Chase can't get these uh, stocks on ledge, it's a it's a really big problem. I feel like both of these players, like the way they're playing, a lot of it is ledge, ledge focused. You know? Yeah, 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 definitely. It's one neutral interaction to to corner player, ledge player. No back here. No jump on Chase. Okay, we're gonna get back to ledge here. The double jump, the back here is it enough? There's oh, yeah. the. Wait, do you have double? Okay, has a double jump here. Works to the ledge here. Nico just walking away. Yeah, just look at that patience. Yeah, he, Nico is completely fine with taking these corner situations, holding on to center stage. He does not have to be the aggressor here. Okay, here we go. Nice conversion. Okay. Was that the double jump? No, there's the oh. double jump. Gets back to the ledge. Okay. Catches the meaty here. He waited. Yep, this time getting the neutral air dodge. Playing patient. Nico has been using that okay. double jump into neutral air dodge to the ground a lot this Go set. Back. 
Russell first. First get up attack. Everybody gets one. Oh, oh no! Oh my goodness. Okay, okay it's fine. Time. Back, he still back. got it. Back here. Oh. oh, that was so close. He's got another chance. Air dodge? No, there's the double oh. jump. This is so close. No, up till I, I, I feel like up till yeah, killed there. <gasps> oh, <laughs> this is. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Nico. No jump. He's got. No. That was what it. A, that what was a recovery. It. He faded back after the neutral air dodge too. Yeah, Very Nico didn't tricky. Want to commit. Very, very tricky from Chase here. Is it enough? <laughs> no way. No way. Oh, oh my. my. God. He got it. He got it. What the? Oh, oh my. Oh, my God. I swear he died first, dude. Oh. No, because Nico didn't hit the sweet spot. Oh, my. He hit the sour spot. Oh. Getting trolled by sour spot. Not if, like this. If he hit the sweet spot, he would have won. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. You're right, dude. And I also think Nico would have won if he committed on that fair off stage when yeah. he went to, for the chase. Because, like, in that situation... Either he would have killed. Right. And then, like, you can't make it back, but they're dead, right? Yeah. Like, at that point, it's like you're almost skill-checking yourself. Like, I'm going to skill-check myself. Like, I'm hitting this. I'm going to react. He had his jump, too. He could have chased full. Yeah. He had no yeah. air dodge. And Powell's drift wasn't the enough. slight hesitation. It'll yeah. get you. It'll, It'll get, get you. you. It'll get anyone. Like, it, 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 it's tough. Yeah. Oh, and man, now that's... Chase opens up with a 68% string. And Nico doesn't get a full stage Nair, he's got the ledge, and Chase gets out. This is a close set. This this set, ooh, this, this, is, this is, is a banger. This, is, this is a this is a banger set right now. And this this is cool too, because we got 818 oh. versus SD. So Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is definitely some uh, some regional rivalry within SoCal as well. For sure. If you didn't know, California's very large, so there's a lot of sub regions. Yeah. I would say California has if you it would if you would separate tri street, we've got like five Five skates of that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that's, a, that's a good way to put it. Five regions of that. Yeah, yeah. Or maybe more. I don't know. Yeah, five like northeast quote unquote states, right? Yeah. Like in terms of like land mass, population, and stuff like that. Yeah, it's just, yeah. there, there's a lot. All right, so first talk here. Who will get this slight edge coming into the rest of this game, number three? This is just to get out of pools. We are having some wild sets here at NSM. Yeah. This is to qualify for winners in top 24, I believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A B, but he didn't, he, he didn't get the straight up one. So yeah, yeah. So so the straight up one will kill earlier? Yeah, the straight up one will kill earlier because it sends more inward. The right. Straight, the I out see. one you can DI. I see, I see. Okay, back there's going to do it. And Eagle's taking the first stock every single game. But obviously straight up is more committal because you just cover less area. It depends on where they hit your shield. Right, right. Okay, okay. I see. And if you want to get to the platform. Oh, wow. Getting out of the neutral area here. And I feel like, for the most part, okay. at, at least game number two, Chase was kind of like playing from behind. Yeah, he um, was. He, like, he made a super huge comeback. Right, right. Box. So here, uh, looking a little bit more even, I mean, both these characters have insane combo games, so it's like, I kind of start both of these players off at around the 50 to 80 range anyway. Yeah. Pay attention to both of their, their spacing. Their spacing is so good. How they play neutral in, in the range when they feel, oh, this guy's too close, I got to dash back. Yeah, yeah. Or I got to jump. They're, they're picking their fights very wisely. Yeah, this is a super neutral based match, which is sick. Love to see it. Yeah, and, and like, I mean, no shade. You just usually don't see a lot of it in Ultimate, so. I got you, I got you. <laughs> okay, DI in on the down throw there. But Nico, talking about neutral, we've been controlling it. And I like that Chase is throwing out a little bit more dash attacks, obviously not just spamming it. But that is one of the counters to like someone that's dashing back a lot in neutral is you, you just overshoot some attacks, right? And yeah. then you kind of put those in check, put make them force to like bring out the shield a little bit more often. And the thing about when you force your opponent the shield, not only um, are you forcing them into a defensive option, you're stopping their movement. You cannot dash and shield at the same time, right? So that in itself, just slowing it down is very, very important. Okay, Chase has to play the combat game again. And, uh, oh, sour spot? spot? Yeah. Uh, up throw might do it soon. Okay, Ooh. back there, yeah. And how many, we've seen Nico get that so much. Like, the barely fade back into, like, you're just in range, bang, hit him with the back air. It's hard because Chase is really trying to fight his way back to the stage, but both these characters punch that kind of mentality really hard. Yeah, yeah. Both of them oh, have, like. It's slipping. It's slipping. It's, slipping. it's, slipping. it's <laughs> not again. It's not again. I don't know if Chase has another comeback in him. He might. We'll he, see. He might in the tank. It, it'll be rough. Okay, he's got to. He's got to do something here. Oh, the down tilt. Okay, let's see. Patience. He's still got the corner. No, Nico runs Ooh. back out. Tries to get a jump here. Ooh, casting out with the damage right now. Okay, he does connect in there. Tries to get a jump. At this point, you're you're gonna need like some kind of jump read or oh something like that. Oh my but god! I don't know if Nico's gonna give it to him. 
Yeah, just going to ledge every time. Oh, the parry no. doesn't get the doesn't Dude, get the. Uh, that sucks because he was in because he was in, because he was in his ledge get up. He ran past him. Yeah, that that is a feels bad. Tries oh, to man. show the ledge roll in. This is gonna be rough. You gotta close the stock out, and you gotta yeah. you gotta be godlike for against a whole, Nico. A whole another stock. Nico's such a consistent player. This is so hard to do against him. Like, and, and the the time is running out too because they're playing so patient. Yeah. There's the back air still Jeremy, not enough. Wow. You got you got to hit this edge yeah. guard. Oh, okay. 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 Oh. We'll take those. Well, he's done it before. Does he have another one in him? Let's see. He's got to play super solid. Okay. That's that's a lot. Okay. Here's one. Are are, are you gonna just take it off stage here? Yep. Okay. Does it, he does. Oh. I thought he was going to be down here. I, I honestly thought he was going to be down here. No. Yeah, that was like the the one opening, barely surviving. He still got, does he still got gas in the tank? Okay, he's back on stage. Uh, okay. The fast fall, I love these fast fall mix-ups from yeah. Chase. When he gets a nair on block, he fast falls it to yeah, uh, it, make the punish time different. His aerial timing is really good. Okay, he's slowly, slowly building up. Oh, that was important for me though. This is close. There's a lot of rage here. Oh, the upbeat. Yeah. Is it going to be it? That's yes, it, it is. Yeah. Catching the roll there. Super good set. Super good set. Probably my favorite set from this tournament so yeah, far. Yeah, yeah. My favorite set so far for 